this gentleman wants to grind this engraving off, but he wants to make sure it's flat. And I told him, well, I have a flat disc. He told me he, the other wheels, the regular round wheels are grinding it uneven. And I said, yeah, duh, this is flat. Look, flat, flat. So we're gonna grind it, they're pretty deep. So the only one I have is a used 120 grit. You can use something heavier. I have an 80 grit, but I don't have one mounted. So this is what we got. Okay, so look, sir, I'm gonna do it. Ready? And you can see right through it. You can look. Bye bye. Oh, wa vitaze, off vitaze. There you go. I'm gonna grind a little bit more. Got everything, and I think I'm good. Okay, we're done. Flat, flat finish. Now, wait, I'm not gonna finish. So, now if you want even crisper finish, okay, so wait, hold on, wait a second. So, take a look at your finish. Kratzer drin, aber die kriegt man jetzt durch den Matt bin ich dann Matt bin ich dann weg. What? You like? Yeah, yeah, it's good. It's good? Okay, fine. Okay, so now I took the Trizac just to make sure you're even. Use Trizac 20 micron and this is going to hopefully combat all those deep lines. So regular And then this will actually tell me how good I ground. So if you want to know the truth, his isn't flat. Do you see that? Take a look at that. I didn't round that. That's original. So even his original is not flat, flat. These guys think they're all flat, perfect. I'll make sure it's flat, but I'm going to grind his whole suit. There we go. Look at that. See that? So right there, we got that down. See? Super flat, super crisp. And you can keep going. So that's Trizac. And this is the 10 micron. What happened? So right here we have the 10 micron finish. You see that? So it's fine. And then you can go to the 5 micron. I'm just showing you all the steps. So we're already finished. I'm just showing yeah. how to get a perfect polished flat. And there, this is the 5 micron. That's the orange. So this is going to assure a really, really quick polish. Okay, so take a look at that finish so we're just need a little light polish and we're good to go see that you see that so this is without polish this is with sandpaper not polished yet let me polish it yeah. if you want remember you told me you want it's super flat like, no, it's matte finish, flat, flat. I can do matte but I'm gonna you want matte or you want polish Okay, just let me show real quick. If you want a polish, he wants a matte finish. But if you want a polish, watch this. Polish, then matte well, just give me a second. I just want to show how quick you can take it to a polish. There 
edges are so sharp. Just real quick how you can take it to a polish. I can even more, but he doesn't want it, but you can go to a ridiculous. Yeah, you can get rid of all the lines within seconds. Look at that. This is the polish. And you can just touch it with a buff. But for the most part, these are line marks from the felt. You see that? You can take a buff and just buff those out. But anyways, so he wants matte. So, had I known that, I would have stayed back to 20 micron. No, I gotta make it even. I can't do a brush. It's gotta be like this. It wants matte. what he wants matte finish and but like let's look can you please do the detail let's look at the very edges look at this it's like had didn't touch the edge didn't roll over it's completely flat and there you go let me get rid of the compound and there you go there you go here's your mat oh so this is the TV mat you like that Flat, dead flat, 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 flat. So how? What you did first? Like what more? What uh, material you use first? And then I use these. Which one is on this? So you would need uh, the regular kit, and then you add this. Okay. 